Have you ever wondered why religion appears to be a universal aspect of human societies, or how it shapes our collective behaviors and individual identities? This question lies at the heart of the anthropology of religion, a fascinating subfield within anthropology that delves deep into the realm of human beliefs, practices, rituals, and institutions. The anthropology of religion didn't take shape overnight. It emerged in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, evolving alongside the development of modern anthropology. Thinkers like Edward Burnett Tyler, James Frazier, and Emile Durkheim were instrumental in laying the groundwork for this study. They focused on understanding the origins and functions of religion in human societies, drawing insights from a diverse range of fields, evolutionary theory, psychology, and sociology. A significant development was the rise of functionalism, championed by scholars such as Bronislaw Malinowski and Emil Durkheim. This approach emphasized the social and psychological functions of religion within societies, shedding light on how religious beliefs and practices contribute to social cohesion, provide meaning and purpose, and address existential concerns. Anthropologists of religion also delve into the symbolic meanings embedded in religious rituals, myths, and symbols. They strive to decipher how rituals communicate and reinforce religious beliefs, values and identities and how symbols are interpreted within specific cultural contexts. Fast forward to the mid 20th century and we see the influence of structuralist approaches shaped by Claude Levi Strauss. These approaches focused on the underlying structures and patterns of meaning in religious systems, analyzing binary oppositions, myths and kinship structures to uncover universal cognitive structures underpinning religious thought and symbolism. In more recent times, cognitive anthropologists have drawn on cognitive science to investigate the cognitive processes involved in religious belief formation, ritual performance, and symbolic interpretation. They explore how humans conceptualize supernatural agents, engage in religious reasoning, and perceive the sacred in everyday life. Modern anthropologists of religion conduct comparative studies across different cultures and societies to identify commonalities and variations in religious beliefs, practices, and institutions. They examine how religion interacts with and adapts to changing social and historical contexts, and how it intersects with other aspects of culture, such as politics, economics, kinship, and gender. They study the roles and statuses of religious specialists, such as priests, shamans, and prophets, and the institutions through which religious authority is organized and maintained. They also explore how religious leadership is legitimized, how religious knowledge is transmitted, and how religious power is exercised within communities. Today, anthropologists are deeply engaged in investigating how globalization, migration, and cultural contact shape religious beliefs and practices, leading to syncretism, revitalization movements, and religious revivalism. They explore the role of religion in shaping individual and collective identities, including ethnicity, nationality, gender, and sexuality, and how religious identities intersect with other social identities. As we move forward, anthropologists are analyzing the rise of secularism, religious pluralism, and religious fundamentalism in contemporary societies and their implications for social cohesion, tolerance, and conflict. In a nutshell, the anthropology of religion is a continually evolving field that seeks to understand the complex role of religion in human societies. From its inception in the late 19th century to the current day, it has shed light on how religious beliefs and practices shape individual and collective behavior, offering profound insights into the human condition.